I, I'm all for the old materialist critique of religion. The old materialist critique of religion, however, doesn't go far enough. Um, some of my work with Caputo and Vadimo in the past, we talked about uh, how the death of God actually liquidates the philosophical basis of atheism. And what we're doing, what Clayton Crockett and I are doing in our new materialism book, is we're applying the same kind of critique about the old materialist critique of religion to opening up a new materialist understanding of religion. And the difference is, the old materialist critique of religion and the likes of people like Feuerbach, Marx, Freud, and others, the great masters of suspicion that I have nothing but respect for. Basically, they used the materialist critique of religion in order to repudiate religion. Religion was seen as nothing but a form of false consciousness. The new materialism we're offering is the same kind of appreciation about the way in which religion functions as a projection, the way in which religion is a form of false consciousness. But instead of understanding this as a means to repudiate religion, what it, what it calls for is the need to radicalize religion, to recognize that religion provides us that unique insight into the way that consciousness works itself. And this is where Zizek comes in. Zizek talks about, let's say, sort of the, the, the efficiency of the symbolic fiction. Religion is this symbolic fiction, but it helps us mobilize politically. It helps us organize ourselves into real communities, and we can see beyond our differences, and we can begin to work towards something real to change the world. So the old materialist critique of religion was animated by this spirit that the point of critique is to change the world. It's not enough to interpret the world. You want to change the world. What the new materialist understanding of religion does is incorporates that critique, but ultimately makes the argument that the means to change the world is not through the repudiation of religion, but through the radicalization of religion. And that's what our project's all about. What the new materialist helps us understand is that religion is about money. Christmas is about money, right? But at the same time, it's not just this critique that religion is a form of false consciousness because it, it, it's sort of complicit in our global economy. But it also helps us understand an alternative way of understanding the economy. So Christmas, we can celebrate the coming of Christ into this world who offers a radically different view of justice, a distributive form of justice as opposed to a uh, retrib retributive, retributive form of justice. I never can say that word just right. So Christmas the same same thing. This, this, is, this is a story by which we can tell ourselves better stories about the kind of people we could and ought to become. Mm -hmm. I'm all for Christmas. <laughs>